what's up? Y'all, I have a twofold problem. One, I have this isn't really a problem, but I bought this tape, masking tape. Not all masking tape was created equal. The tape, the tape with the words on it that, you know, it says uh, sharp line, multi-surface, the most expensive, for the most part, blue tape sucks, in my opinion, compared to just the regular uh, regular blue tape without that marking on it, just the plain, basic, not cheap, cheap, but actual, you know, Scotch brand tape, but just not the... Not the ultra super awesome. This is the 2093. And the other problem I had was I have, y'all Y'all have seen the videos, you know, we switched out to LED, which I hate. I hate. Just might want to throw that in, but I hate them because I can't do slow motion video now because it screws up the screw it makes it flash of course i still have to do that one back there which i'm actually approaching even though that's been like that for a minute now i just hadn't i just hadn't had it in me to climb a ladder and now that i've got mount boxmore see that was that's over mount boxmore so now that i got mount boxmore down i can you know start thinking about doing that again so that was one of the things that definitely had to be done the other thing is is as i was replacing all these bulbs Guess what that left me with? A bunch of eight foot bulbs. The problem comes into play is our hazardous material disposal unit in Jackson won't take eight foot bulbs. They'll take four foot bulbs, but they won't take eight foot bulbs. So normally, ah! Oh, oh, oh. Normally, what I do with those is I'll wrap them in just plastic bags and break them. But because I have so many this time and I had that tape, I thought to myself, hey, let's do this. And that is tape them all together. So when I break them, it'll all stay in the tape, right? Now, you know, I've got a few gaps here and there. And it's an incredible waste of tape, but the roll of tape was like, it was like six bucks. And again, I'm not fond of it except for painting. If I was using it for painting purposes, then it would be okay. We've got about eight bulbs in here, I believe. We still have not covered the ends yet. But in theory, once I, once I whack this, it's going to all crumble down. And then I can whack the rest of it down and it'll all be caught by the adhesive of the tape and not as many dangerous fumes. They always say breaking fluorescent bulbs is bad. It's got, it's got that fluorescent stuff in it that's just bad for your health. So you can't just, uh, you know, have fun breaking it like a glass bottle or anything because it does release, it's just a hazardous material. And, uh, oh my goodness, look at that. Let's come down here. Let's come down here. We've got a loose thing here. So how many do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten bulbs, that's right. And we are about to get rid of them. So the only other thing I'm going to do, just to collect the shards, is uh, normally what I do, this is what I normally do when it's just one or two. One or two bulbs, but we are just going to pick this. And, uh, and then just wrap it. That way, when it all pours out the end, let's, uh, let's lift it, give it a little room up there. There we go. I'm just gonna take, um, there we go. Take this guy like this. Come on, tighten up. Tighten up, you. There we go. Do that. I'm gonna do that on both ends. Actually, I may use the remainder. Stay there, don't move. Where'd the remainder of the tape go? Found it. Ah. Ah. 
it's definitely going to use the last of it. I do have to go to Lowe's today. Uh, but again, I've just been trying to get rid of this tape. And this seemed like a really good use for it. Safety third, y'all. Safety. Hey, wait. Let go. Hey, wait. Let go. I don't want to take keys with me. There we go. Just like that. Ha ha. And then we'll do the other end. And everything should be good to go, right? All right. How bad of an idea is this, y'all? I mean, I think it's a pretty good idea, honestly. I think it's a pretty good idea. Safely destroy and get rid of uh, environmental problem. Old fluorescent bulbs. There we go. Last of the tape. Looks like we have none left. Okay, come up here. Come up here. Now, in theory, this should all just crumble. All right. The uh, the tape will catch. The tape will catch most of it, and the rest should uh, just dump down in the bags. Right, am I right? I'm, I'm right. Let's go outside. Do need to locate my safety goggles. Goggles, goggles. Safety goggles get moved around so often. There's a pair. Ew, that's a terrible pair. I got, I got, there's a new pair right there. Ha ha. Yeah. Let's go. Oh, a mask. All right. I think the most suitable place for this is, uh, is in the back parking lot here. Hopefully the glass will be kept to a minimum, but I might have to come back and sweep. Uh, uh, um, eh, no, let's not do that there. Let's not do this here. Here we go. We could do it over there, but uh, hmm. the easiest place to sweep would probably be like right here. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. All right, hold up. Well, it it was loud, louder than I expected, but it did its purpose. We have all broken, and uh, and let's see if we can't get this. Let's see if we can't get this uh, wrapped up, right? Oh no! Okay, need a garbage bag. I'll be right back. Stay there. Walking back, I found this on the ground. And uh, we all know what that is, and it shouldn't have been out there, and that's not a brand that I carry. So, somebody lost their thing. I probably should have brought a, a bag and shit. Oh well.
Okay. Uh, so I lost clean back up. Didn't go as well as I'd hoped. Whatever. They're, they're finished. Now we can just dump them in the regular garbage. And, uh, and be done with them. Finally got rid of the eight foot balls. Whew.